Billy Clapper was more than a craftsman. He was a symbol of the American West. His spurs were worn by working cowboys and rodeo legends. He dedicated his life to preserving tradition. Clapper's story is one of hard work, passion, and the enduring spirit of the cowboy. Clapper's legacy extends beyond the spurs themselves. He embodied the values of the cowboy way of life, honesty, integrity, and respect. His work ethic and dedication to his craft inspired many. Billy Clapper was a true artisan, leaving an unforgettable mark on Western culture. Billy Clapper's journey began on a sprawling ranch in the heart of rural Wyoming. The vast open landscapes and the rugged beauty of the terrain were the backdrop to his formative years. From the tender age of five, Billy was no stranger to the demands of ranch life. He learned the value of hard work at a young age, rising with the sun to carry out his chores. Whether it was carrying heavy hay bales or cleaning out the barn, every task was a lesson in responsibility and perseverance. Days were spent under the vast Wyoming sky, tending to the cattle that roamed the dusty plains. The rhythmic clanging of metal and the creak of leather were constant companions as he and the other ranch hands mended fences and herded cattle on horseback. Each day was a testament to the grit and determination required to maintain the ranch. The cowboy life was all he knew. Evenings were spent around a campfire, sharing stories and songs with fellow cowboys. The camaraderie and the sense of belonging were as much a part of his education as the physical labor. Riding through the open range, Billy felt a deep connection to the land and the life he was leading. It was in these early years that Clapper developed a deep appreciation for the tools of the trade. The leather reins, the sturdy saddles, and the intricately designed spurs were not just equipment, they were extensions of the cowboy's identity. Each tool had a story, a purpose, and a craftsmanship that fascinated young Billy. One day, a seasoned ranch hand named Jake took Clapper under his wing. Jake was a master craftsman, known for his skill in creating the finest spurs in the region. He saw potential in Billy and decided to pass on his knowledge. The bond between mentor and apprentice grew strong as they worked side by side. Jake taught him the art of spur making, a meticulous process that required patience and precision. From selecting the right metal to shaping it with care, every step was an opportunity to learn. The workshop became a sanctuary where Billy could immerse himself in the craft. Clapper was captivated by the process. The transformation of raw materials into functional art was nothing short of magical. He spent countless hours honing his skills, driven by a passion that grew with each completed piece. The clang of the hammer and the hiss of the forge were music to his ears. He learned to shape metal with finesse, carve leather with intricate designs, and assemble each piece with precision. The attention to detail was paramount, and Billy took pride in every spur he crafted. Each creation was a testament to his dedication and growing expertise. This marked the beginning of Clapper's lifelong passion. What started as a simple interest blossomed into a career that combined his love for the cowboy life with his newfound craft. Billy Clapper's journey from a ranch hand to a master craftsman was a testament to the power of mentorship, hard work, and an unwavering passion for one's craft. Clapper's spurs were more than just tools. They were works of art. Each pair was crafted with meticulous care. He used traditional methods passed down through generations. Clapper believed in using only the finest materials. He sourced high-quality metals and the toughest leathers. What set Clapper's spurs apart was his signature style. He incorporated intricate silverwork into his designs. Each piece told a story. Some featured images of wildlife, while others celebrated rodeo scenes. His spurs were both beautiful and functional. They quickly gained a reputation for their quality and craftsmanship. Word of Clapper's craftsmanship spread quickly. Soon, he was receiving orders from far and wide. Ranchers, cowboys, and rodeo riders all sought his spurs. What began as a hobby was transforming into a full-time endeavor. Clapper faced a difficult choice. He could continue working on the ranch, or, he could take a leap of faith and pursue spur making full time. It was a risk, but Clapper's passion for his craft could not be ignored. He decided to dedicate himself entirely to his art. Section five, life beyond the forge, family and fatherhood. This chapter delves into the personal side of Clapper's life, exploring how he balanced his demanding career with the joys and responsibilities of family life. As Clapper's business grew, so too did his personal life. 
The forge was not just a place of work, but a symbol of his dedication and perseverance. It was here that he learned the importance of balance. He met and married his wife, Sarah, a woman who shared his love for the open plains and the rugged beauty of the ranch. Their wedding was a celebration of their shared dreams and aspirations. Together, they built a life filled with love and laughter. Their home became a sanctuary where the stresses of the outside world melted away, replaced by the warmth of family bonds. They welcomed two children into the world, each bringing their own unique joy and challenges. The ranch became a playground for their kids, a place where they could explore and grow. Clapper was a devoted family man. He made it a point to be present in his children's lives, attending school events, and being there for bedtime stories and morning breakfasts. He cherished the time spent with his loved ones. Weekends were often filled with family activities, from horseback riding to picnics by the creek, creating memories that would last a lifetime. Balancing work and family was important to him. He understood that success at work meant little if it came at the expense of family happiness. He often said, a man's true wealth is the love of his family. Clapper instilled in his children the same values of hard work and dedication. He believed that these principles were the foundation of a fulfilling life. He taught them the value of a hard day's work and the satisfaction that comes from a job well done. He taught them to pursue their passions with the same fervor he brought to his craft. Whether it was working with their hands or following their own dreams, Clapper encouraged his children to be the best they could be, always reminding them that the sky was the limit. Family dinners were a sacred time where stories were shared and traditions were passed down. It was during these moments that the true essence of family was felt, a bond that was unbreakable and everlasting. Holidays and special occasions were celebrated with great enthusiasm. The ranch would come alive with laughter and joy as family and friends gathered to celebrate the milestones of life. Clapper's legacy was not just in the iron he forged, but in the family he nurtured. His children grew up with a deep sense of responsibility and a strong work ethic, values that would guide them throughout their lives. In the quiet moments, as the sun set over the ranch, Clapper would often reflect on his journey. He knew that the true measure of a man was not in his accomplishments, but in the love and respect of his family. Family and fatherhood were the cornerstones of Clapper's life. They were the driving force behind his every action, the reason he worked so hard, and the source of his greatest joy. In the end, it was his family that defined him, a legacy of love and dedication that would endure for generations. Section 6. Finding Balance, Clapper on Work and Life In a rare interview, Clapper shared his thoughts on balancing work and family. It's all about priorities, he said. Family comes first, always. He believed in setting aside dedicated time for his loved ones. Clapper understood the importance of being present. Evenings were spent sharing meals and stories. Weekends were reserved for family outings. Clapper's workshop was always open to his children. He encouraged their curiosity and creativity. Clapper's life was a testament to the power of balance. Section 7. Yellowstone's Tribute, A Heartfelt Farewell In its final season, the acclaimed television series Yellowstone paid a moving tribute to Billy Clapper, a name synonymous with the art of spur making. The show, known for its authentic portrayal of Western life, featured a storyline centered around a pair of Clapper's spurs, which are considered masterpieces in the world of cowboy gear. The episode showcased the legacy of the renowned craftsman, delving into his meticulous process and the passion he poured into each piece. The tribute resonated deeply with viewers, many of whom were moved by the heartfelt portrayal of Clapper's life and work. It served as a reminder of the enduring spirit of the American West, a spirit that Clapper embodied through his dedication to his craft. Clapper's story, woven into the fabric of the show, highlighted the importance of tradition and craftsmanship, values that are often overlooked in today's fast-paced world. It was a fitting homage to a man who dedicated his life to preserving Western heritage, ensuring that the skills and stories of the past are not forgotten. The episode not only celebrated Clapper's work, but also educated viewers on the significance of spurs in cowboy culture, explaining how these small yet essential items are a symbol of a cowboy's identity and pride. Through interviews with those who knew Clapper personally, the show painted a vivid picture of a man who was as much a part of the landscape as the mountains and rivers that define the West. Friends and family members shared anecdotes, 
recalling how Clapper's eyes would light up when he spoke about his work, and how he would spend hours perfecting each spur to ensure it met his high standards. The episode also highlighted the impact of Clapper's spurs on the rodeo circuit, where many top riders consider them a badge of honor and a testament to their own dedication and skill. As the sun set on the final season of Yellowstone, the tribute to Billy Clapper stood out as a poignant reminder of the 